In recent years the Red Sox have opened the doors to Fenway Park to some of the entertainment world's biggest stars. In the last few years alone, I've gotten to see Pearl Jam and the Foo Fighters perform at Fenway. Something I never thought would be a possibility. See, Fenway Park is a cathedral of baseball and for the longest time, it was treated as such. The grass was measured to make sure it was the perfect length. The drainage would be tested to guarantee it wouldn't flood the field during the storm. And every square foot of the park would be monitored and manicured by the grounds team. I remember when I was a kid my family and I took a tour of Fenway and, well, it was pretty damn magical. Something about being field level and staring up at the green monster, it's indescribable. One memory from that tour has been forever burned into my mind though. Being the curious young baseball fan that I was, I just had to touch the grass. I learned a lesson that day and I learned it fast. You never touch the grass at Fenway Park. The tour guide didn't waste a second to let me know to get back on the warning track and just how carefully the field is protected. Fast forward several years and Fenway Park hosts several events a year between entertainment and sports. If you told young me that bands would set their stages up in center field and there would be seating in the infield, he'd refer you to the tour guide. That leads us to the big event coming in February. The Red Bull Crash Dice event will be the host to the Ice Cross Downhill World Championship. The competition will pit heats of four skaters speeding downhill side by side. The Red Sox have been giving some behind-the-scenes looks at the construction of the massive ice track, and it's impressive. Red Bull Crash Dice will span two days over February 8th. The event will crown juniors, male and female champions. Early stages of the competition will begin on Friday with the early qualifying that will set the field for the later stages and finals on Saturday. This is sure to be a huge event for not only the Red Sox and Fenway Park but obviously Red Bull as well. From what I've seen from the Red Sox the course will start at the top of the ramp next to the Jumbotron in center field and finish at home plate. With more and more events and entertainers coming to Fenway Park, this could be huge for Boston. Next, Tyler Thornburg could emerge as Red Sox closer in 2019 any chance to bring more acts into the city and allow people to enjoy the charm of Boston could only mean great things. I for one am pretty excited to see how this is going to play out as I've never watched Ice Cross. But from what I've seen in highlights it looks absolutely wild. Red Bull Crash Dice takes place over two days from February 8th, 9th and tickets are available through the Red Sox website.